bacteria and fungi structure of a bacterial cell observe the structure of a bacterial cell shown here the flagellum provides motility the slime layer protects the cell from desiccation and antibiotics increases the pathogenicity of bacteria the cell wall being permeable allows free movement of water and ions and protects the cell the cell membrane being semi permeable allows water and only certain ions to enter the cell the cytoplasm contains ribosomes and in some bacteria photosynthetic lamellae the glycogen granules and fat globules reserve food material the nuclear material contains genetic material dna ribosome takes part in protein synthesis bacterial shapes observe the different forms of bacteria bacteria have been classified on the basis of their general shapes the four classes are bacillus Caucus Spiralum and Vibrio Economic importance of bacteria. Bacteria play an important role in industries. Some important activities of bacteria are mentioned here. In medicine, antibiotics such as streptomycin and chloromycetin are obtained from bacteria. Bacteria are used in the preparation of serum and vaccines. In industry, Lactobacillus helps in formation of curd and cheese. Mycoderma is used in the manufacture of vinegar. Certain bacteria are useful in retting of fiber, curing of tea leaves and tanning of leather. Bacteria are also used in the preparation of industrial products such as lactic acid, citric acid, acetone and alcohols. The nitrogen cycle in nature. Observe carefully the nitrogen cycle in nature. The process of conversion of atmospheric nitrogen into essential nitrogenous compounds and the decomposition of these compounds back to gaseous nitrogen constitutes the nitrogen cycle. Role of soil bacteria. Ammonification. Anaerobic bacteria acts upon dead animal protein and converts the organic compound into ammonia. Nitrification. The aerobic bacteria oxidizes ammonia into nitrates and nitrites. The nitrosifying bacteria oxidizes ammonia into nitrates. For example, nitrosomonas. The nitrifying bacteria oxidizes nitrites into nitrates, for example, nitrobacter. Nitrogen fixation. Free nitrogen is converted into ammonia, amino acids and proteins. Denitrification. Anaerobic bacteria breaks up ammonia into free nitrogen, for example, bacterium denitricans. Differences between rhizopus and muca. Observe the diagram to see the differences between rhizopus and muca. The mycelium of rhizopus has rhizoids in clusters on the lower side of the node. The rhizoids of muca 
are inconspicuous and arise anywhere. Prostate hyphae, called stolons, are found in rhizoids, whereas stolons are absent in muca. In rhizopus, several sporangiophores arise from a single node. Sporangiophores occur singly in muca. Life cycle of fungi. Observe the schema carefully to understand the life cycle of fungi. Economic importance of fungi. Economic importance of fungi is summarized here. In the food industry, some mushrooms are edible. Yeast is used in the preparation of bread, pizzas, cheese, alcoholic beverages. In medicine, many types of antibiotics are obtained from fungi. Penicillin and erythromycin are examples of such antibiotics. Certain fungi are used in the synthesis of fats and proteins. They are also used in the synthesis of vitamins and enzymes. Role of fungi in agriculture Fungi are helpful in maintaining soil fertility. Harmful effects of fungi. Fungi cause a large number of serious diseases in human beings and plants. They also spoil the food. Fungi also cause tropical deterioration.